Hey guys, my name is Corey with Midstate RV, and I'm here today to show you a Coachman Concord. It's a 2015 model, and this one is a, has two slides. They're both on the other side. You'll see them here in a second. Um, taking a look at the coach, it's built on the Ford e E450 chassis. It has the Triton V10 engine in it. It's a 6.8 liter, has four, 420 pounds of torque and 305 horsepower. So a lot of power here in the here in the engine. If you're looking down the side of it, one of the first things you'll notice is it does have, have blinker cameras. The blinker cameras allow you to see what's in the lanes beside you as you're, as you're moving in and out of traffic. It's a really, really nice safety feature. Aside from the, from the mirrors being really far out so you can see it, see all the way down without a problem. As you're looking down, it also has the running boards to help you step up in. It makes it a lot easier. And they're, they're color-infused fiberglass, so they're gonna match the coach. The paint job on it, it's a full body paint, so there's not a, it's not stickers. So it, it's gotta hold up a lot better and look, and look a lot better doing it down the road. It's got a huge awning um, to give you a nice big front porch. It's a powered awning, so just push a button, it comes right out. The, the door on it is an 80 inch tall door. It has the radiuses on the top, so as you open and close the door, if it does touch the awning, it's not gonna rip it. Um, you also have a big outdoor entertainment center. It's a 32 inch TV, two big Jensen, Jensen subwoofer speakers. They sound really awesome. Um, a lot of storage compartments. You have one down here below and one at the very back of the coach here. And here on the other side of the coach, you'll notice the big fiberglass front cap. Helps keep everything, all, all, the, all the water out. It's a really good feature. On the slides, you see that they both have slide toppers on them. The slide toppers are good because if you're parked in an area with a lot of tree cover, you get you know, leaves or limbs fall on it, you just roll it right back in and, the, and all the debris comes right off the top. Um, the generator is located right down here. It's a, it's a coming zone in 4,000 watt generator. Um, you have more cars in the apartments as you look underneath. And as you go further back, I know you probably can't see it, but there's an the outside shower right in between the two of these slides. Hey guys, we're inside the coach now and I'm gonna show you a few features um, throughout the coach. First off, you'll notice the big 32 inch t um, screen TV up front with the, with the entertainment center. The entertainment center is, is CD, DVD, Bluetooth, pretty much everything that you could, you could wanna plug into it. And down here, you'll notice both of the chairs turn around to give you more seating area through, through here. Um, you do have the monitor for the backup for the backup and the blinker cameras that we talked about. Um, and there's also, on here too, there's a, a control for the leveling system. The leveling system um, helps stabilize the coach and it keeps it from, from rocking and moving. It's on the big, the, it has the big, the big cord here for the remote, so you can step outside. And if, it's, if you're on really unlevel ground, you can eyeball it and get the coach in the right, in the right position. As we're walking back, has a nice jackknife sofa. They're real, real simple to operate. Lift up, pull down, and you got a bed. Just that quick. Um, putting it up is about the same thing. Lift up, pull in, and back in place. You notice know, seat belts throughout to give additional seating during during travel. You have the dinette. It's also the seat belts again. You have the the big storage drawers underneath. Notice the drawer goes all the way back, so you don't have to dig up, dig back behind there. And they're all on the, on the ball bearing slides. Real simple to pull out. The dinette also makes a bed. Just pull off, pull, pull the top off the table. It drops down to this level, and you fill it in with the cushions here. So it makes a nice, nice bed. You can easily get two adults on it. Um, on, on this side, you've got the galley. It's a three burner stove with a with the convection microwave underneath so you can still bake. The got a two-door fridge with the ice box up top and plenty of storage below, which is a nice feature. It's a gas electric fridge so it can run both ways. Um, back over back over this way you've got a you've got a stainless steel sink with the cover and a pull-out sprayer which makes, makes it a whole lot easier for just about anything that you need to, need to do with it. One neat feature on this coach right here too, it, 
it has a it has an electric fireplace. Electric fireplaces are really useful because if you when you're at a park you can you can use it to heat the coach instead of having to use your propane. Uh, it also gives a really nice look. Coming back through, you have a split bathroom. On the uh, on this side you have the have the nice shower with the with, with, with the pull-out handle there's a, a dome up top to give you a little bit more headroom. So even somebody about 6'4 or 6'5 can fit in there. Opposite of the bed, you see there's plenty of closet space. There's plenty of hanging space here, here on the other side. Um, there's also a spot for a television up here and a cable plug-in and three additional drawers for additional storage. Hey guys, thanks for joining me. My name is Corey with Mid-State RV. We're the camping experts since 1989.